Wanna do some buff out? Maybe a little psycho. Don't mind me.
game!
Watch out for the mines. Uh, quick, they're coming. Lock and load. They'll be here any sec. You made enough noise coming in here to wake the dead, for God's sakes. Just be ready. The muties are coming. Over here! Bring it! Hang tight. There's always a second wave. Hey, you're pretty decent in a firefight. Well, with what I do for a living, you need to be. Sorry, I'm being a complete asshole. I'm Sydney. It's good to meet a fellow relic hunter. Come on. You and I both know this is where the Declaration of Independence is stashed. No need to be coy about it. Good old Abraham Washington sent you on the same suicide mission he sent me on. Only problem is... You're not going to get it without my help. Simple. We pool our resources, grab the Declaration, and make for Rivet City, and split the reward. I've studied the plans of this place. So without me, you are going to go in circles. What do you say? Smart move. Okay. The Declaration is secured in the Archive's strong room underground. There's a concealed cargo lift right here in the center of the rotunda. I've spent a few days hacking the lock with my remote terminal. When you're ready, punch in the password, let's get going. All I know is that it looks like a rolled up piece of thick paper with all kinds of writing on it. Some famous document from a long time ago. Abraham Washington is a huge US history nut. So, that's why he wants it so badly. Ha! <laughs> I'm surprised that you care. Usually everyone looks out for themselves nowadays. What is it you want to know? I don't know. I grew up like pretty much every other girl in this crappy world. Spent most of my life just trying to keep away from slavers. One day out in the wastes, I stumbled across some poor bastard's body. On the body I found info leading to some famous document. I had heard that Abraham Washington was looking for these scraps of paper. So I went after the thing. Turned out to be the Constitution. After he loaded me up with caps, I got pissed drunk, got laid, and was happy for the first time in a while. I haven't looked back since. Oh no. There is more than a lifetime supply of grade-A crap in that place. Couldn't possibly do it alone. Like you, he hires anyone off the street. Honestly, I don't care what he does with that stuff. As long as the caps keep flowing, I'll be there to collect. Yeah, it is nice. I don't even sleep without it under my pillow. My father made gun ammunition for a living. Taught me everything about how firearms work. So, I've spent my downtime tinkering with guns like my 10mm Ultra SMG here. It's like a hobby, I guess. Sorry, there's some things I still want to keep to myself. Maybe when I get to trust you better. Okay. There's a cargo lift right here in the rotunda. It should take us directly down to the lower levels. I was hacking the system right before we were attacked. The code should be, we the people. Nope, I'm fine. Just watch yourself. Because I'm not dragging your corpse back to Rivet City.
lot. suggest we head back to the rotunda and take the cargo lift. I heard something. Where? Found you. Oh. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You want some of this? What's up? It's only a scratch. Thanks. I'll use it right away. What's up? It's only a script. Thanks. I'll use it right away. What's up? It's a thing. What's up? Just watch yourself, because I'm not dragging your corpse back to Rivet City. I address you with a message of utmost urgency. Our defenses have been breached. in the archive strong room that's at the end of the east Men, wing here. We we'll can't have to make let our way to it. Progress dissuade us There's from all sorts task. of shortcuts through maintenance doors and utility gates. Over here! There! Had enough? What's up? I got your back. Analysis. Green. Standing down. Ow! 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 You like that? That takes care of that. What's up? 
It's only... Thanks. What's up? Nope, I'm fine. Keep your eyes on the mission, and off my ass, please. It's only... What's up? It... Thank... What's up? Come on. Less gawking and more walking. Defenses, evaded our best soldiers, and you've raided my home. But I have not yet begun to fight. I cannot allow you to steal our freedom. The Declaration must remain here. It is our symbol of hope, the one thing that cries out we are a free nation. I am not a robot. I am Button Gwinnett. Second signer of the Declaration of Independence and Distinguished Representative from Georgia. I know your fighting prowess far exceeds my own, but I will still duel you to the death if I must. 
What will it be, then? Rapiers? Pistols at dawn? Out with it! This is no mere document, sir. This is the doctrine laid down by my fellow members of the Second Continental Congress. It absolves us of the tyranny of King George III of Great Britain. It is perhaps the greatest symbol of this free nation. Broken promises and deceit may be the way of Great Britain's crown, but I will not succumb to such tomfoolery. Since it appears you wish to resolve this without bloodshed, may I suggest you stand down and surrender? I can promise that you will be treated well, in a manner accustomed to any member of the Royal Army. Very well, but any attempt to take the Declaration of Independence will be considered an act of war. If you 
have something to say. Very well. When you're listening to Galaxy News Radio, we're Radio Free Wasteland, and we're here. Wish not so much to live long as to live well. something to say. Please explain, but I warn you, I am well versed on the tactics of the underhanded Redcoat spy. You do well to remember that. You, sir. Interesting. I had a plan for just... We create... If you were to bring the best place to find some would Excellent. Please hey. I hear the thumping of the The journey will be rife with peril, I'm afraid. You cross Farmer Smith's cornfield and make your way up Greenleaf Hill. Ford your way across Quick Run Creek and make for the horse path. When the pines thin out, you need to make your way along the edge of Arlington. Watch out for redcoats. They have a garrison there. The building across from the fish market is the library. Look for the old clock tower. I'm afraid until I know exactly what your intentions are, I can't divulge that top secret information. 
Oh, very well. There's no harm in that. Yes, I was proud to participate in the signing of the Declaration of Independence, along with 55 of my fellow freedom fighters. It was an honor to have my signature among those of Benjamin Franklin, Thomas Jefferson, and John Adams. Except maybe for Hancock, that show-off. On July 4th, 1776, the Second Continental Congress declared that the original 13 colonies of America were now free and independent states. This paper stated their intentions to sever all ties with the monarchy in Great Britain and operate as an independent nation. It's perhaps the single most important document in United States history. Very well. The Lee Resolution, enacted two days earlier, was the actual independence declaration. The declaration itself was an expansion of that resolution for public consumption. The Declaration of Independence wasn't fully signed by all of the delegates until August 2nd, 1776. And the Have you reached a decision? I think you'll find that to be very difficult when you'll soon be hanging from the gallows outside the State House in Philadelphia. Yeah, yeah, you're my hero. Don't let it go to your head. Seriously. 
Thank you, Page. Everything looks okay here. Wait to add the declaration. Indeed I am. Although there were several copies made of the document, I certainly never expected to come across one intact. What do you say to 75 caps for it? Thank you very much. Oh my lord, I never expect... I mean, I'm utterly shocked. You two have earned your places in the annals of American history. Yes, indeed. You will be remembered for this great day. I will award Sydney's promised bounty to her personally. No need to worry yourself about that. Enjoy your reward, my friend. You've earned it. What's up? Huh. I'm surprised that you care. What is... Yeah. It is nice. My father made... And I thought he was the best. My mom was long gone, so all we had was each other. He used to call me his little moonbeam. <laughs> How sappy is that? But when I was 14, he vanished and left me all alone. Never even said goodbye. I cried for a week. Do I have to tell you what it's like for a young woman alone in the wasteland at that age? I don't know where he went, and I don't care. I just hope he got what he deserved, the son of a bitch. What? Oh, oh my god. That's his voice. It's really him! I... I can't believe you brought this to me. Oh, I don't know what to say, but... Thank you. Wait, here. Take my 10mm Ultra SMG. It's never let me down. Besides, I won't really need it anymore. You know, I think I've had my fill of wasteland roaming and picking through ruined buildings for a while. I'm just gonna kick back and spend my caps. But thanks for asking. 
Well, now that we brought back the declaration, I think I'll take my cut of the earnings and head out to get drunk. Look me up in the underworld if you ever need me. I usually hang there since ghouls don't hit on me all the time. Bye. God bless you, and keep you safe. That is a thing of the past. I told her to stay away from me forever. God bless you. Good to see you. Yes? Yes? I'm not supposed to talk Hello. to strangers. Rather be alone Are you now. lost? Yeah? We're the lucky one. We have... Yes? Yeah? Goodbye! short on time and your five minutes are up. See ya. If you want any of this shit, just say so. But... Thanks. Come... That's secure for a reason. Thank you. 
Who's out there? Yeah. Hearing those damn noises again. I'm gonna this tear is you bullshit. Ah, uh, this is Kick not fun. Kick Call ass. the doctor. We got a trader. <laughs>
What's your business, stranger? Hannibal says I gotta let folks like you in, but that don't mean I have to like it. Keep your hands in sight and don't make any sudden moves. I'm coming down to open the gate. Hannibal is upstairs somewhere. I'm locking the door behind you, so don't try anything. I'm watching you. You ain't supposed to be looking at me to say nothing of talking to me. Now beat it. Hannibal is waiting for you. Ah, a visitor. Welcome to the Temple of the Union. I'm not going to ask you who you are. For the moment, I don't care. We are all escaped slaves. I need your solemn promise not to betray us to Paradise Falls or the slavers. Until I get that, you cannot leave here. So, do I have your word? Welcome, brother, to the Temple of the Union. Our home is your home. Your past is your own affair, so long as you serve our common good. As a symbol of our trust, here is a key to the gate. That's Abraham Lincoln, the great emancipator. We don't know how it came to be here, but it's fitting, don't you think? We are trying to make a safe haven for all runaway slaves. We give food and supplies to any that find us and help them on their way. What? For 23 years I was a slave, ever since I was 14. Six years ago I managed to escape from my master. He's been hunting me ever since. When I found the head of Lincoln here, I knew it was a sign for me to help other slaves to escape. I founded the Temple of the Union as a safe haven for runaway slaves everywhere. May the spirit of the great Lincoln protect you. I'm turning in. I need to be sharp tomorrow. You don't look like much, stranger. Bet you run from rad roaches. I'm Simone Cameron. Don't fuck with me. Hannibal says I can't shoot you, but I ain't trusting you with a gun to my back. This place is the death of all slavers. Maybe someday, the death of slavery. Hannibal has a plan. We're too small right now, but someday we'll be big enough to take them on. I shoot nosy people. What the hell do you think I do? I protect this place. Not for long. Me and my Merc crew were captured by slavers. Seven months I groveled and obeyed like a good lapdog. When I saw my chance, I took it. I had nowhere else to go. Hannibal took me in. He never cared about my past. Don't let me stop you. Yes? You're new. I'm Caleb. If you're going to be staying in town, I could use some help. Long time ago. Eight years, I think. Three of us escaped during the night. They caught Liza and John. I made it into the wasteland. Raiders took me in at first. When I heard about this place, I knew I had to come here. We are the only hope for runaway slaves everywhere. 
Rivet City and the Citadel can't be bothered with helping slaves. They turn a blind eye. We are the only ones willing to stand against Paradise Falls and slavery. My former master trained me in masonry. I fix things. Someday I hope to reattach Lincoln's head to the statue in the memorial. Okay. Hannibal says you're on our side. My name is Alejandra. I'm an historian. I also tinker with pre-war machines. My dream is to build a shrine to the great Abraham Lincoln. Yes, for four years. I was young and pretty. I don't need to tell you what my duties were. He liked me enough to educate me. I learned reading, history, math and even some science. When my master married, his wife insisted I get sold. Hannibal bought me and freed me. We're all runaways. Hannibal wants to make this a place for all escaped slaves, but it's too small. Take care of yourself. Hey, are you trying to piss me off? Goddamn rookie, that's Lincoln. He freed some slaves a long time ago. If you want to know more, come listen to Hannibal give his speech. He does it right after the noon meal. Ugh, right. We are grateful for any help you can give us. Ah, it is our newest brother. <laughs> what can I do for you? May the spirit of the great... My name is Bill. Bill Seward, if you please, sir. Oh, yes. All my life. One day, I killed the master's little girl. It was an accident, I swear. I... I ran away. They would never have believed me. Hannibal found me. I would never have made it without him. A bit of this and a bit of that. Whatever Mr. Hannibal needs. I look after the animals, cook our meals, clean up, things like that. Oh, sir, this place is heaven. Just a little bit of heaven here in the wasteland. Any slave makes it here, he's free. Just like that. And Mr. Hannibal, he's got a plan. A plan for heaven to be everywhere, not just here. A bit of this. I... Yes, sir. safe out there. What? Oh, I didn't see you there. I'm in a...
Hey. Yeah? My former... Sup? Okay. Looking for your fix? Let's see what the good doctor has in his magic bag, shall we? Another satisfied customer? <laughs> 